Hey, this is the LaRose Bros. And today we've dropped a crab pot with a GoPro attached to it. We're going to be showing you some of the fish and crabs we've seen while doing this. And over there there's a staghorn sculpin. They're pretty common. And this one looks like it might be trying to get the bait we put in the crab pot. Now it looks like it's swimming over to the sand looking around for something there. I wonder what it's looking for. There's probably some food right there. It looks like these crabs are fighting over our sardines that we put in there. Yeah, crabs usually like the sardines. We've used bait ranging from chicken legs to salmon, but sardines always do good. Looks like a cormorant down there in the bottom. You can kind of see it. Looks like right now it's looking for some bait fish or something. Cormorants usually eat. Look around in like the rocks in the bottom of the ocean to look for little bait fish like maybe shiners, pile perch, whatever they can find. Yeah, they're pretty common around the pier since it's not very deep water. Especially directly under the pier where it's shallow and there are a lot of rocks. Oh hey look, there's another fish. It looks like it's a white spotted greenling. Yeah, these fish are actually not very common. They're not, they kind of avoid fishermen. Oh, look! Oh, it's a lean cod, nice. These are highly predatorial fish, and they're some of the top predators, so they can get really big. Looks like here we see a pile perch. You can identify them by the black stripe that runs down their silver body. Yep, they make for pretty good eating, actually. There's his little friend. A painted greenling. Yep, they're pretty common. Although, like the white spotted greenling, they're not caught very often. Oh, a salmon. Nice. Salmon. Cool. Here we see a spotted ratfish. Yeah, they're not very good to eat. They're pretty ugly but they are cool fish yeah we've caught some before in crab pot and on our poles well that's all thanks for watching see you next time